Speaker, and today was an important victory for parents who deserve to have a say in their kids' education. It's unbelievable that here in Washington, you didn't see everybody coming together for such a basic right, uh, the Parents' Bill of Rights, the fact that not a single Democrat would vote to allow parents to have a say in their kids' education shows you how extreme this Democrat Party has become in Washington. And yet parents have been calling for this for two years. We saw during COVID with shutdowns, with lockdowns, where parents actually got to look beneath the veil, actually got to see what was happening in their kids' education. And many were alarmed that they weren't seeing their kids learning reading, writing, and arithmetic. They actually were seeing things that made them concerned to ask questions like, can I see my kids' curriculum? And they were even more shocked when they found out that there were union bosses who didn't want their kids to be able uh, to find out what was going on in the classroom. They didn't want the parents to know. Uh, and so we brought forward the Parents' Bill of Rights. And I applaud Julia Letlow, uh, Virginia Fox, all the members of the Education Committee for making this a priority. As Speaker McCarthy said, when we laid out in our commitment to America, if we got the majority, we would actually go fight for those families who have been left behind. And up here in Washington, some issues should be so straightforward that everybody should come together. But if they're not, then at least we're willing to stand up and fight for those parents, for those kids who were being left behind, who were being denied opportunity. And so here in Washington today, members of Congress had a choice to make. Do you stand with union bosses or parents and their kids? There was no middle button to press. You either sided with the union bosses who don't want parents to see what's happening in the classroom or you side with the parents and their kids. And all of us here today are proud to say we, as House Republicans, sided with parents having a right to be involved in their kids' education. And if the Democrats are gonna to be too extreme as they showed they are today, we're gonna to continue to fight for them anyway. And let's have the Senate hear from parents all across America. Let's have President Biden hear from parents all across America and maybe they'll get the message. But in the meantime, we're gonna keep fighting for them. The man who delivered the votes as our whip, Tom Emmer. Great job.